What is good, YouTube world? It's your boy, guess who? Mondo One Next, and I am back with another one. And today, I'm gonna teach you how to pass a cotton swab drug test 2021 step. I made a video last year, you can also check that out to you know, be sure that you're gonna pass your drug test, but I'm making a more up-to-date video today. I'm gonna pretty much use the same thing and do the same thing, but it's more up-to-date, so that matters. All right, so, I'm gonna be demonstrating three things in this video. It's more things that you will need or that can help you out. You don't necessarily need them, but that will definitely help you out. So, first off, I got some hydrogen peroxide. This is, I believe it's 2%. It's been a minute since I checked. 3%, I'll take that back. 3%, this is 3% hydrogen peroxide. I also got some Listerine. You wanna get the original one because I believe like with the flavored ones, it's something that's missing. I'm not sure. And then also, you want to make sure you have you some toothpaste. You got to brush your teeth too. So, and then the other things that you could get to help you out, like, you know, you get you some mint gum, some Altoids, some breath strips. I have breath strips in my car. Then I'm also going to give me some Altoids and some gum. Just because just just I want to be on the safe side because I smoked last night. Oh, yeah. And another thing too, you know, I was working at Amazon and I just stopped working there maybe about two weeks ago. Now I'm about to go try and be a security guard for Allied. So yes, another same process, another kind of swab drug test. I got my drug test at 3.30 today and it is currently like, I believe it's like 2 o'clock. I mean, I've been preparing a little bit, but not to the full extent, but we about to get right on to it. I'm about to demonstrate to you how I brush my teeth and rinse my mouth off with the Listerine and the hydrogen peroxide. Let's go ahead and jump straight into it. All right, so first off, we're gonna start with the hydrogen peroxide. I like to do it in order where less burn to most burn, if that makes sense. So I go from hydrogen peroxide to mouthwash to brushing your teeth. Or you can do brushing your teeth, then go to, you know, to the mouthwash, but I'd rather go ahead and get the liquids out the way first, and then go ahead and finish it off with brushing your teeth. You want to make sure you do this a good amount of time too. You don't want to just do it two, three, four times. You want to try to get you a good about six to 12. Nah, I take that back. Not even six, eight to 12. You want to make sure you get you a good little, make sure you get some good rinses in, especially if you did just smoke a day before. Now, if you haven't smoked in a few days, then you don't have to do it as much. But, you know, if you did last night like me or even the day of, you want to make sure you do it as much as you can. So first off, this is the, Hydrogen peroxide. You wanna to try to hold this in your mouth for about a good minute. You probably wanna get that. Maybe I'll probably say at least about 45 seconds, you know, for one run. So I'm gonna show you how I do it. So go ahead and throw it in there. Two thousand years later. And I'm pushing that pack, yeah, I do a rent up a check, I gotta get to you. You talking that shit, but you ain't gonna do shit. Do it like night, so nigga, just do it. He must be scared, cause he move like a bitch. Let me tell you something, little weak ass snitch. You speak with my name, you gonna learn from that shit. You don't wanna smoke you. Alright, so that was the hydrogen peroxide. Now, I feel like that one is the least, that's the most calmest out of all of them. Cause when, even when brushing your teeth, when you gotta go hard on the gums, you're not used to brushing, like, you know, certain areas of your mouth, so you kinda feel it. You feel it. Tell me you're gonna feel it. Now we're about to go ahead and do the Listerine. I can tell you this, I'm not gonna last with this. It's just impossible to last with Listerine in your mouth for more than 30 seconds. I mean, you could possibly get 30 seconds, but it just had some hydrogen peroxide in your mouth to kind of like, you know, touch up the cuts. So this is gonna put the icing on the cake for the cuts. Now go ahead and do the Listerine. Watch how long I last. I don't have to fast forward this or nothing like that because I'm not gonna last that long. Final one, I'm not sure how I brush my teeth. Now, like I said, this ain't gonna be like the average, you know, you just brush your teeth. You gotta get the gums real good. You wanna go ahead and brush your mouth. I mean, not your mouth, your tongue. Get under your tongue, get the size of your mouth. You know, get the little cracks of your gums. Like, you gotta get all around. You pretty much wanna brush 100% of your mouth if you can. So we better go ahead, brush your teeth. Show you how I do it. Like, you know you're doing it right whenever you start kind of like having like little drool come out of your mouth and stuff like that. You know, I mean, I know that's nasty or whatever, but 
you got to do what you got to do to pass this drug test so you can get that money. So let's go ahead and get on into brushing our teeth. So, you know, what I usually do, I go ahead and, you know, normally brush my teeth and then I go back and get the gums, you know. Now for the gums. Like your mouth feels really fresh with like a little zesty feeling like it. it's kind of uncomfortable because your mouth like i said your mouth not used to all that hydroperoxide or listerine coming back to back you know usually just do about three two three times a day so yeah and you know some more advice i can give you know if you are like trying to plan on which side you're going to put the cotton swab on usually i go with the um, right side so I try to aim a little harder to go a little harder with the left, right side, but make sure you're still doing the same, you know, to the left too, because you just, you don't really know the process of the saliva, you know, you don't know how it works, you don't know how the saliva flows, so, yeah, like I said, and other things, you know, like I said, you want to make sure you get some mentos if you don't, you know, get you some mint gum, breath strips, and then, um, drink a lot of water too, you know, water clears up the saliva, you know other than that you know i just hope you guys learn and i hope you guys pass and get that job so you can get that money like how i'm about to get to so until next time you guys already know what to do you know show some love by liking and comment and make sure you hit that subscribe button with the bell because we got more content coming soon and until next time it's your boy mondo and i hope you get that job and we out bam Hey you, are you getting tired of being in the present time? Do you ever just want to go back in time? Well it's your boy Mondo and we're about to go time traveling. I'm taking trips floating through the sky Like I'm Marty McFly Went back to the year 89 Back when Shorty was fine The last message she sent wasn't mine Yeah she just wasted time She ended up pregnant started lying Yes trying to say it was mine